Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Mobile Freak, and today we will test uh, speed between these two devices. We have Huawei P30 on our left side, and we have Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus Exynos variant on our right side. Let's quickly check that everything is closed in the background and we can quickly power them off and after that we will turn them on and we will see which one of them is faster at boot up. Let's wait for that and guys when you're waiting just please click the subscribe button and help me to reach that 13k goal. Thank you very much. So let's just uh, right now turn them on at the same time three two one go and see which one of them is faster at boot up and S9 Plus is slightly faster. So we'll just quickly turn off auto adjust, uh, turn off automatic brightness on this P30. Check everything is closed in the background. No recent apps, no recent used apps, and we can start right now with the phone dialer P30 messages also P30 Play Store. P30 a lot faster. Let's go with settings. P30. We have YouTube right now. P30. You can check my videos, but if you're looking at this one, you already did that. Let's go with the. Did I open settings? Yes, I did. Let's go with right now Facebook. P30, WhatsApp, also P30, Viber, P30 again, Instagram, P30 like instant, Wish, P30, Snapchat, P30, Jetpack Joyride, let's say it, and slightly faster on P30, but I will redo this Jetpack Joyride because I don't think this was the right open you know, time for P30 because P30 is a lot faster. But it's pretty much the same. Let's go back to home screen. Here right now, Assault 9 Legends. P30, a lot faster. Not a lot faster, but you know, it's really faster. Let's go with Angry Birds 2. P40 again. Let's go with you know subway surface and guys in day-to-day -day usage you will notice the difference of course if you really need uh, speed for your phone you will notice the difference between Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus and P40 because I used S9 Plus like a daily like about two months uh, ago and I was used that phone around 10 days and it was you know and uh, uh, starting really to slow down, um, it's not that, you know, much of the, like, a really slow phone, it's not even close to like that, but still, uh, 
there is a lot faster phones compared to this S9 Plus nowadays and you know it's not more like flagship when you're using it you know it's it's really like some mid-range phone let's go back to home screen again P30 speed test by Okla let's go with P30 first and I used P30 and I didn't see any lag or something like that. It was like everything is really uh, instant, but on S9 Plus or S9, it's not like that. You know, you will see some waiting, some lag, sometimes not, you, you know, ex, um, just you need to understand that when you just start the phone, it will be fresh, you know, and uh, there will not be some problems or something like that but if you're starting to full that storage and you, uh, when you're starting to just uh fast open that apps i even set the you know uh, animation to 0 0.5 so i can just i don't like to eliminate animation because it's just not you know what i want from the phone but uh, I just need uh, s more speed in the phone and I just set it to 0 0.5 and still I'm not like what I see when it comes to the speed, you know, it's, I need to wait something, you know, I click and then wait and then again you can do something. For my job is not great to wait because when I start to uploading some photos and something on my job, it just need a fast phone because my I make some muscle memory when I just Doom, doom, bam, bam, left side, you know, uh, top right, and everything is just, just really fast. But when I do that on S9, it's not that fast because I need to wait the phone so I can, so I can, you know, continue. But you know, for someone who don't pretty much care for speed, maybe in some case. S9 Plus is better choice, but you need to uh, find some someone in a really good condition. But if you ask me, P40 Pro without thinking about S9 Plus. And right now we'll see the difference in FreeMark test between these two devices. And by that score, you will see which one will perform better, you know, in games. And of course, it's not every single time like that, but you will get the some information about how strong your device is for gaming. And these are the results, pretty, pretty close. And it's pretty much like same in game. You will get really great performance on both of these two devices, but Exynos will likely, uh, you know, start to thermal throttle after some, you know, gameplay. You need to know that P30 can even do better by tuning uh, turning on a GPU turbo, you know, which is a really great option, but this one, this test uh, was, you know, without that. And that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Peace.